I'm Chris, and this is Jaime, and this is our sweet pup, Bo. Welcome to the Green Home. Two years ago, we made the big leap of moving from our 600 square foot apartment in Miami, Florida, to a fixer upper in the mountains of Bryson City, North Carolina. It was a big change. Join us on our adventures as we show you what it's like to move from a big city to a small town in the Smoky Mountains. This week we're doing something a little different on the green home. We're taking you on a road trip down to Miami. 13 hours in the car. Bo is unfortunately miserable about it. But there'll be a big payoff at the end as we're going to get to spend Christmas and New Year's with the family. We're also going to be showing you a little bit of our old stomping grounds and celebrating a big milestone for Chris's book. So grab a glass of eggnog and join us. Check the mic and make sure it sound right, boys. Pretty though. Oh, we're not lost. We're not lost. No, just uh, took a longer route to get to a bathroom. Lori Beach is pretty cool. <laughs> I know, Bo. I feel the same way. All right, we stopped at a Walgreens in Delray Beach. Bo just took Bo to relieve herself, and Jaime is inside. And I'm trying to get her to drink some water, and she won't because she's smelling everything. She's so happy to be here still an hour away, you know, like that last hour is just the worst. That's kind of how I feel, but it's okay. We're gonna get there soon. You don't wanna drink any water, huh, Bo? day so I am dropping off seven copies of my book to the books and books in Coconut Grove Miami which is our favorite neighborhood it's where we um, first moved in together and we still have an apartment there and I love this bookstore and I can't believe it's gonna be so weird to see my book there it's gonna be awesome not weird <sighs> What are we celebrating? Chris Ramos Green? Oh, my are getting... mm -hmm. Celebrating the Brace Hat Girl in Books and Books. Cheers to that. So proud of you. Girl.
It's Christmas in Miami. We've got palm trees all around. The sun is shining. Really enjoying hanging out with the family down here and um, being in Miami again. I would never move back down here. And at the same time, it's, uh, it's great to visit what feels like home. So the only thing missing is my side of the family, which is a little sad, um, but it's okay. You know, it's been a weird year. So my mom, um, she lives in Spain with my Spanish side of the family. And so she's unfortunately not been able to make it over here for the holidays where she usually does. And then this year, since we came down to Miami, um, my dad and brother and dad's side of family that live up in North Carolina are up there. So that's the update. It's where we're at. Cheers to y'all. I hope everybody out there is enjoying their families and their holidays as best they can. I'll show you a little bit of what's going on here at the San Miguel residence. It's a good one because I'm blurry and you look beautiful. Is, no. Oh, is this for YouTube? It's for YouTube. <laughs> I'm trying again. Hey, Christmas. Merry Christmas. We're here in Miami at my parents' house, my childhood home. We are. And we're having Spanish beer. <laughs> Which is nice. It's really it's cool. Different. It's a change of pace. They don't have this in North Carolina. They don't. Um, I feel like we have to show the doll. We have a doll, we have a situation with gifts. Uh, one of our presents for our very good friends was broken and my mom performed doll surgery and added these adorable little pom-poms <laughs> because there's a tear. I don't think you can see the tear. Oh yeah, you can kind of see the stitches where Bo ate the toy. Now she's as good as new. 
We've had an awesome time being back home. We've got a lot of things done. We're just really grateful to be spending some time with family. Haim is outside playing with Bo. We're gonna have some Cuban food, which I'm so stoked about, um, and some Spanish wine, and just have a really amazing time here. And it's a lovely way to end our first week down in Miami, back home for some time. So uh, we'll show you what that is, and then we'll see you next week for New Year's.